Assalamu alaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh In this video, I'm going to demonstrate how to use Casio FX570EX scientific calculator to solve simultaneous equations uh, with three unknowns. Uh, in this problem, I have three equations which is I2 plus I3 is equal to I1. That's the first equation. The second equation is 30 is equal to 40 I1 plus 10 I2. And the last equation is 10 is equal to 40 I3 minus 10 I2. Now the unknowns uh, are I1, I2 and I3. Now before we use the calculator to solve for the value of I1, I2 and I3, we need to rearrange all the equation into the general form of ax plus by plus cz is equals to d. Now in this problem, I choose x as i1, y as i2, and z as i3. Therefore, the first equation can be rewritten as i1 minus i2 minus i3 is equals to 0. For the second equation, we can write the equation as 40i1 plus 10i2 We don't have i3 for this equation, so that should be written as 0 i3 is equals to 30. And the last equation, we don't have i1 in this equation, so that is 0 i1 minus 10 i2 plus 40 i3 is equals to 10. So now we can use the calculator to solve the simultaneous equations. So when we press the setup button, we can choose several functions and we want to find the equations. So the equation is right next to uh, the table function. So this is the equation and we press A that button. So we need to choose now between simultaneous equation and polynomial. So obviously we want to choose simultaneous equation. So press one and we are prompt to choose the numbers of unknowns. In my problem, we have three unknowns. So we press three and we are prompt to key in the value for A, B, C and Z. Uh, a, B, C, and D. So for the first one, the value for A is 1, negative 1, negative 1, and that is equals to 0. For the second equation, we have 40. positive 10, 0, and 30. And the last equation, we have 0, negative 10, 40, and D is equals to 10. So we let the calculator solve the equation. So we have X, X is I1 is equals to 0 0.667 and i is actually a current so i need to write the unit for the current i is equals to 0 0.667 ampere for i2 we have 0 0.333 ampere and the value of I3 is also equal to 0 0.333 ampere. So that's all for this video. 
we already solved the simultaneous equation by using scientific calculator of Casio a model FX570EX. For other models, you can check the links in the description below. So that's all. Thank you for watching.